Hello guys and welcome back to a new video. Today I have right here with me the new Audi RS3 uh, 2019 model. This car right here in front of me has 400 horsepower and uh, it look fantastic. It look much much better than the RS3 uh, the hatchback version and also I love these rims. Uh, look how beautiful they are on this um, RS3. Uh, they are gorgeous. Um, really, really uh, very, very powerful car. And also very beautiful car as well. The car have a lot of new technology on it. Uh, as you can see in the front there, the radar for adaptive cruise control, LED lamps, and many, many more. You can see here, for example, uh, RS3 limousine or sedan, the way you want to call it, 2,500 uh, liter 5-cylinder uh, petrol 7-gear S-Tronic Quattro, the price 85,100 francs, dollars, uh, euro, it's around 80,000 euro. Here are the options, if you are interested, you can pause the video and check it out here. Um, Again, some information about the car, the the consumption and all that stuff. So you can pause the video and check it out. Here we have the new technology LED lamps, adaptive LED lamps. They are great in the night. They are one of the best. Also the parking sensors in the front. Also on the front wheel, we have the parking sensors and all this plastic in the front. It's a glossy plastic, black glossy plastic. Uh, that look very nice. I really like these days. Many manufacturers come with this glossy plastic uh, around on the exterior of the car and also in the um, interior of the car. And it look really, really beautiful in my opinion. Uh, this plastic look fantastic. RS3 logo right here on the side. Also the Quadro uh, logo on gray. The um, Radar here in the front for adaptive cruise control, emergency brake. Also down here, the the front uh, bumper look really nice. Also the hood, like classic with two lines on the side. Uh, a little bit of shape. There we have the camera for lane assist and reading the sign, uh, and the, the road sign. Also the mirrors in black glossy. We have uh, LED blinker here on the side um, and also um, as you know on the interior side we have the uh, blind spot uh, sign here we have the keyless entrance in the car the doors are fantastic the way uh, they close the way you hear when they close are gorgeous i also love this black glossy plastic around the edges of the windows I see it on the new BMW X7 as well as on a lot of new cars these days. Uh, this glossy plastic starting to take advantage in 2019-2020 uh, on many, many cars. Uh, it will scratch very easy, but uh, it looks fantastic. Also down here we have all white um, and a little bit of shapes. Also up here we have some shapes very beautiful shapes that come from the from the back to the front uh, of the car you can see that line come directly from the front directly right here in the back to the back uh, light and i like it i like the way they designed the car uh, it is a classic beautiful sedan car um, like we see back in the days with a lot of power and uh, very beautiful shapes. The rims here look also very nice. The tires P0, like usually all the great cars these days have it. Uh, we have 20 inch wheels here and Sport Audi Sport uh, rims, uh, disc brakes, the caliper, you can see it, nothing special on it. Just uh, the discs are a little bit bigger, so at a high speed. They can break. I was expecting to have a ventilated disc on this car. Uh, at 400 horsepower, you really need that. 
for a good breaking. Also, the spoiler in the back looked fantastic on black, glossy, and the shape of the back of the car, it's, it's phenomenal. We have parking sensors in the back, RS3 logo, the exhaust pipe are gorgeous, very big and nice, glossy plastic in the back, air diffuser down here, also the back camera up there, quite beautiful and uh, yeah I love I love the back of the car and also the LED lamps look uh, gorgeous I like I like them very very much in my opinion they are one of the best also in the trunk here we have a lot of space as you can see it also the triangle up there huge space entrance in the car we have a little bit of lip here we have space on the left, on the right, uh, right here in the car. Also under the, the, the floor, we have another uh, space, storage space. We have the battery and a lot of space that you can put uh, stuff down there. Also there you can leave the seats down and you can, uh, uh, you can carry a lot of stuff. So let's show you now, right now. Let's leave down these seats and let's show you how cool is that because it's almost flat here. I think it's, it's almost, actually it's flat. Also you have a lot of space on the feet there to, to put some stuff. And from here if you watch it, it's, it's flat there. So you can even uh, carry long items without any problem. I like that. This is a great plus for the car. Also, everything in this car, I have to tell you, in the interior, and uh, it's, it's high quality. Also, the doors are very nice, big windows, tinted windows, uh, soft materials on the door, nice design. Uh, we have LED lights in the interior there. We have also this Alcantara here on the door, a speaker, the leather with white stitches, Bang Olufsen speaker, good quality audio, uh, sound, uh, and a space for a bottle or whatever going inside. We have leather seats, um, they are really nice design and uh, also very comfortable, uh, as you can see here in the images. In the middle, we don't have any uh, middle console, kind of impressed about this. Uh, this choice of Audi to don't put any middle console there. Here we have two USB port and the vent. That is a great, great uh, plus for the car, going inside the car. And let's show you the space on my legs. It's a huge space on my legs. Also, even if the, the seat in the front is in the normal position, I can stick my legs under the front seat. We have LED light under the front seat, closing the door, great visibility on the windows. As you can see, uh, great position of, of staying here. A lot of space on my head, no problem on my head. I think two or three fingers are up there. Also, we have a hook and a handle. Up here, we have LED lamps on the roof as well as great also uh, going in the middle of the car we have a lot of space on my legs even if the passenger seat it's way in the back also on my head i have i think one two fingers there if i stay in normal position if i go a little bit in the front i have much more space and the comfort it's quite okay uh, for free people in the back here, maybe not for long trips, maybe for short trips it's okay, no problem, but for long trips it will be complicated. But when you, when you stay in, in the normal position, it's really great. I don't like these big seats from the back, from the passengers in the back. You don't see so well in the front, you see these big seats uh, and only on your window, so that's this kind of visibility in the front is not so good. But yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, now the, the car have also this LED down here that illuminates in the night, uh, Audi Sport. Great quality on the front doors as well. Alcantara, 
uh, buttons great with chrome uh, the same speaker a lot of space for globe and, and for the bottle rs3 logo on we have led light there in the night look great also the seats are manually adjustable leather seat side support great great comfort and they are really good for for a car with 400 horsepower quite impressive uh, aluminum pedals down there the light uh, you can adjust it from here uh, as you know it on Audis not so many things change from 2013 also up here the dashboard is the same design um, as you know it it's great quality uh, soft materials also the vents are great uh, they are a little bit changed from the 2013 model. They are a little bit different, but uh, yeah, almost uh, almost the same, just a little bit of difference. So going forward, the buttons, the the climatic system is the same. Uh, everything here is the same. Also the climatic and also the navigation system is the same, uh, as you know it just that this new navigation system m may free it has uh, a connection to the internet a bigger screen and uh, a nicer better map also the google map can connect we have usb down there 12 volt board two cup holders led lights down there in cup holders uh, i like that i don't have it on my car but in the rest my car look perfect like this only I don't have any USB port uh, the vents are a little bit different and this thing here doesn't have this LED light uh, the center console also the screen is a little bit bigger than the older version and also these buttons here I all also have it auto hold and uh, electric handbrake I have it on my car here the armrest it's leather white stitches pretty awesome also you can charge your phone this here I cannot do it in my car and also you have a USB port down there and auxiliary port so pretty cool also the start stop button is there this controller for the navigation it's one of the best on the market start stop button I like it very much and also the stick it's fantastic with Alcantara right here in the middle it's really great this stick here I really like it really really cool anyway the steering wheel it's the same uh, in the front we have the new digital cockpit uh, that it's fabulous one of the best on the market today uh, you can adjust and you can customize the way you want it we have a speaker on the a pillar there great quality on the roof handle the mirror up here it's also great quality um and uh, yeah also here in the middle we have led lights no place for glasses i don't understand the woody uh, if you hear me just make that glass support up there in the roof it's very very useful there is the camera and the uh, technology for lane assist and reading the uh, traffic sign Great visibility on the windows as you expected from Audi make great great cars uh, they think about everything the steering wheel it's gorgeous really gorgeous uh, we have Alcantara with leather combination the buttons the areas the everything there it's, it's super cool also great visibility in the back the seats you already see it before and yeah the the position of driving it, it's fabulous in this car and also we have these clappers here look how cool they look these uh, clappers and also the buttons for changing the different settings in the cockpit you already see in my other videos if you didn't see this new cockpit from Audi or multimedia system you can check out my other videos on my channel um, I have it on my channel a lot of videos and you can see there all the information there in the back we have the adaptive cruise control stick controller from there you can control 
all the the things uh, all the cruise control anyway the control to adjust different setting and the uh, multimedia system you can see there all the option we have uh, in the car the car the telephone media radio navigation and all that stuff are uh, pretty easy to use it's pretty intuitive the resolution it's good uh, and everything it's, it's actually great I really like it the card Audi connect uh, also on the Audi connect you can see the weather you can see you can connect to the internet and you can see all kind of great information that you you didn't expect for example uh, like uh, I will show you in a moment here is the weather for the for today and also for the next hours something that's really cool to have it here uh, really fast you can also have the weather map and all that stuff for the region you can see even the the parking place or you can see the the price of the gasoline around you so you can see here the price around you, how many kilometer, and w which has the better price. So you can directly uh, drive there. How cool is that to see the price? Uh, it's, it's really amazing, really super cool to see, to find the price of the gasoline uh, in the area that you are. Uh, you can see the cheaper one and, and it's, it's fabulous. I really like that. It's really cool. Really, really cool. So, all going forward, a lot of information here. You can also search online and all that stuff. It's it's it has a lot of stuff interesting here in the new uh, multimedia system. Something that I didn't, I don't have on my car, and I wish I had on my car. Um, you can also connect your smartphone. Um, and you can connect it to the Google map and all that stuff uh, but anyway I don't want to go into too many details uh, I think you know it already about this system from Audi uh, the navigation it's also fabulous also you can you have shortcut button here in the center console you can control connect your phone as well uh, Bluetooth navigation you see it already it has great maps, great resolution, uh, and it's really, really good. Uh, anyway, yeah. So, um, I guess, guys, that was my review with the new Audi RS3. Here, you can re you can you can actually uh, make the letters right here with your hand. And it will appear immediately appear there. For example, N. You can see E. I I just write there, and everything is go directly there. So it's a really cool feature to have it on these new cars that you can write the address with your finger, and then it gets you directly there. It's quite quite great. Also, when you start it, it's charged very fast, and you have a lot of information. Also, you can see it on the cockpit with display anyway so um, I guess that was my review with the new Audi RS3 2019 model um, sedan version it's a great pleasure to see this car to be in this car um, and I hope you enjoy it guys I hope it was helpful for you if you have question or uh, something just write me in the comment down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out my other videos and thank you very much for watching my videos guys i wait your feedbacks and um see you soon stay safe drive safe and see you soon guys bye